You are enterprising in your outlook and can anticipate beneficial change. You may begin a new stage in your education, or use some new information that will increase your sense of independence. You may be involved in humanitarian activities with your professional colleagues. Generally, your thoughts are progressive as you tend to blend unorthodox and conventional views together. This transit makes you more self-confident. With your enthusiasm you can fire people into action to achieve team goals. Also, you can gain cooperation from people in the public sector through your innovative ideas. The transit of Jupiter conjunct your natal Uranus has the most surprising quality of all, and a need for freedom that can take several responsibilities away from you that were necessary for your growth. Ironically, this is what is needed for your growth. The important thing is to balance the desire for freedom and do not escape from impediments that will benefit you in the long run. You must control your desire for freedom and trust that it will come anyway, and that it may appear in the most unexpected way. You can make radical decisions that free you, when other times you would not dare to make them. Here are new possibilities to discover yourself, to expand your consciousness and to see things from a completely different angle. This idealism and enlightenment can come from finding completely different people, new friendships, or coming into contact with groups that help you to develop inwardly, enlarge your conscience or make social reforms. One of the ways in which this can manifest is through travel and studies, which have a great impact on your understanding and greatly enrich your life. You can make many changes and enrich your life by suddenly understanding what it is you need to live more fully without ties to the past. You have the confidence to try things that offer you opportunities that were, before now, unknown. Love and private life. If you suddenly find yourself rebelling, there is a good reason for this. You have probably been too patient and accepted situations that were wrong for you for too long. From this perspective, your strong reactions just serve to bring things back into equilibrium. Your partner may see this differently. He was very comfortable before and perhaps cannot understand why things should suddenly take such a different course. Your awakening brings turmoil into your relationship. It really does not matter to you whether your partner seems capable of handling this. In the final analysis, you are the most important person. If your partner can no longer cope with you, then he will have to draw his own conclusions. And if he fails to do this, you will. It may actually be fine with you that the relationship no longer works since this gives you a way to get out of it. Your present need for more space to develop is so great that a relationship can quickly feel too restrictive. But if you have a good relationship, your partner will understand that he needs to grant you more space for personal development right now. A good partner knows that your growth will feed the relationship with valuable new impulses. A good partner will accompany your development with interest and goodwill. If you resonate with this reading, don't forget to subscribe.